Hello and welcome back to 7 Days to Die Wasteland. Today we're going to be continuing with the quest to try and get tier 4 complete. Now I'm doing tier 3s so they're a little bit safer because I don't know if you've noticed but the wasteland is crazy and I'm game stage 115. So the easier quests I can do the better but tier 1s and 2s are a little bit slow for progression for my taste. Alright we've got a fetch and clear not too far away. We've got 3 reasonably close jobs we could do today. I think I need to do 4 though. So I might have to do some tier 2s just to even it out, but let's start with that. Ranger Station Alpha 700 meters away. Have I got any skill points? I didn't check. I've got one. What am I saving that for? Probably something in strength. I'm going to trust past me to have done that for a reason. <laughs> so let's head over to Ranger Station Alpha and see if we can get this quest done quickly. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get four done today or like three and two tier 2s done, but I'll definitely be able to get it in this episode. Problem is, is, I'm doing a lot of stuff, and I might not get any good rewards from it. If I just keep grinding the books, that's the most important thing. And I need to max out the workstation books so I can just be done with that and put all those intellect points into something actually useful. That would really help with those higher level quests if I had, like, most of my skill points not dedicated to skill books, which they currently are. Thanks, Learn by Reading System. You're the best. <laughs> Thank god I was on the bike. I didn't even hear that bear. I heard it once and then there was nothing and then it hit me. Oh my god, move. Ow. Just so you know, if I was off the bike and that thing hit me, it would do like 80 damage. Why is it still even aggroed? That's, that's too long of an aggro range for a bear. Fuck off. <laughs> Leave me alone. Oh, I hate Wasteland Wilderness PYs. One second, there's a bag here. Hey. Wait, I heard someone burping at me. Was it a mutated zombie? Hi. There we go. Let's start this and get away from the bear. Oh, there's a dog in here. I see a marker, but I don't actually see who I'm apparently looking at. Where are they? Where are they hiding? Hmm, suspicious. There we go. We've angered somebody. Oh, hello, Feral. Ooh, lucky headbutt. Pell, are you going to come out here and fight me? Oh, I can't close that. Come over here. Oh, he's going around. We didn't piss off the bear, at least. Hey, soldier. Come here. Stop hitting the truck. Oh, the eyes dumb. I'm still expecting a dog in here, because there's usually a kennel wherever there's a dog. Oh, behind me? Okay, I don't know if there's any ferals gonna get on top of the truck before I find out. Now they're just normals, okay. Maybe I'm lucky and there is no dog then. Here we go. Ah, level 5 wrench, thank you. Oh shit! I did so much damage! He was just standing there. I have to eat like all of my bandages. He did so much damage. It's fucked up. There's a fucking another one! Oh no, is it just a normal one? No, it is a feral biker, yeah. <laughs> At least now I got a shot off on him so he's stunned and he won't run as fast. skill points. I guess I'll just put that in strength for now. Oh, I don't like this. Are they all above? Or below? What are we? I feel like I can see their eyes. Yeah, there's at least one feral there. See why I'm not going into tier 4s when the tier 3s are doing this shit? It's not even including the bloody infestations. I don't want to think about the infestations again. Maybe up here? Nope. Unspeakable things wait above, no doubt. Run over that. Oh, that's annoying. Oh, he fell. Is there anyone above me? Speed check, you are a normal guy. And so are you. Good. Right, the lack of it being clear is concerning. Shotgun out. Actually, I should repair this. 
Hello? This is suspiciously quiet. Ball book. Run away! There's at least two vultures. I would like to fight them on more even footing. Here we go. Right. You're just a guy. That's fine. I swear to God, if that biker has glowing eyes, I'm gonna sue you. Okay. There we go, now we're clear. Grab the satchel and check the loot. I can only do a thousand damage to this chest before I run out of stamina. This is going to take so very long. All that for a forge ahead. At least I got one of my first aid bandages back. And the treasure map, that might be useful. In this biome, at least the loot will be good. Ish. Okay, it'll be leveled highly if there's any leveled loot in it, but there usually isn't. Let's go back to Jen and take another quest. Hopefully the bear is not in the POI with me right now, which it actually is. It is actually in the POI with me right now. Why is it doing that? Oh, there, I... Bear. 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 Bear in the POI. I get it, game. There's bears in this biome. Chill out about it. The Wasteland is like that one friend you have who gets a new interest and that becomes their entire personality forever. Except instead of like coffee or trains, it's fucking bears. I've just described a furry, haven't I? Hmm. Hey, Jen. Here's your pay for a job well done. Oh, finally, a pump shotgun. Thank you. Didn't realize that was in the loot table for this, but I will gladly accept it. Okay, what other jobs do you have, Jen? Uh, clear zombies one kilometer I've south. A bit of a problem. Sure. Thanks, son. Let's get cycling. I need 15 more um, vehicle books in order to make a motorcycle. Maybe I should search more of these gas station POIs that I find, because I do have many points, see, in Grease Monkey, so it is actually a decent source of them. Hello. Bye. Who broke in here? Maybe that was during Horde Night or something. More arrows, thank you. I'm expecting a feral biker in here, because there's always, like, a biker. So I don't see why it wouldn't be a feral. Well, it's usually in this part of the building, so maybe I already aggroed it or something. Already up here? I guess no biker for me in here, then. Lucky me. And loot with some random shit in it. Let's check this. Working stiff tools crate. I need a fucking few blocks. Here we go. Oh, handy land. Boo. I don't even build bases. Okay, but there's another room over here. Hang on. Got a more power crate, but that's fine. Those are also a pretty good source of uh, vehicle magazines, actually. See? Right, we need 13 more. Yeah, I'm definitely going to be checking more cars and gas stations as I go, because I'm really sick of cycling. And I forget that when you have so many points in Grease Monkey, you really can just rely on non-bookstores to get them. If I see an electronic shop, though, that would probably be the best place. I search this bus? No, I haven't. Let's search it. Uh, nothing helpful there, okay. Now here's another vehicle POI. Paid tree auto. Anybody in this area here? Hello? I hear someone. Hi. Hi. What do we have in there? A guy in a passing gas container. Hello, Feral. Goodbye, Feral. A lockpick's in the trash pile. Thank you, game. And there. Car parts box, come on. Yes. Another crate here. Oh, it's just a working stiff tools, but it's better than nothing. Still has a chance to give you vehicles, I think, but it's not as high as other things. Let's continue. I've already searched that gas station over there before, by the way. Here we are, US Army Post 7. This one's gonna be a nightmare. Hello? Anybody in here? Hi. You fiddle. He was. Can I make first aid bandages yet? Of course I can. Great. Anyone up in these towers? Yes, hi. Good evening. Island cabinet, gimme. Oh. Did we piss someone off? We did. Someone's presumably up here. Hello? Hey. 
Hey, he's just hiding there. Another filing cabinet with fake hairs. Hey, Lumberjack. How are you? Hey, bookcase. Oh, that has a lot of books. None of which are ones I want. Well, I'm fine with the forge ahead, to be fair, but still. Ah, this has passing gas containers, doesn't it? Yes. Two, at least. Paper. Wheel. Blue. Come on, passing gas container. Give me at least one. Yes. Got a skill point. Probably want to save that for seven strength. Then again, I probably want to wait for the cigar to just give me that. So maybe not, actually. Hmm. I don't know what to do then. I'll just hold on to it for now. Impact bracing mod. Do I have one of those? I do. Give me another one. Come on. Yes. Right, we only need ten more. That's decent. I'm cooking weekly. Need to go dump some stuff in the bike. Ugh. Ah, shit. I pissed someone off there now. Let's get the bike is full. Let's see. Don't need that shit. Eat that. Let's see put the mods on something. That would help. You know, my club could probably do with the barbed wire, to be honest. Lead damage is quite helpful. Uh, there's the vehicle adventures, nice. Need nine more. Oh, there's a dog outside. It's not really my problem, because it's on the other side of a concrete wall. So, I'm good. It'll get through eventually, but that's future me's problem. Yes, desks, those also have books. Other vehicle adventures there. Ignore the floating computer, don't look at it. Ignore this as well. Another filing cabinet with forge head comb. Some ammo. Oh good, a weighted head as well. Put that on my club. Extra knockdown is always good. Okay, we're in the final room now. This is going to be terrible, isn't it? Okay, four guys isn't too bad, but how many of them are feral? Can I aim this bow correctly, please? There we go. He's feral. Ooh, that was close. How is he stuck? Oh, fuck off, game. <laughs> Ah, oh, what a perfectly functional game this is. Stop crawling! There's no reason to crawl. It is a perfectly standable room. I bled out nice. We're still not clear. Interesting. Well, let's get the loot anyway. Big hitters and some arrows. A bunch of ammo and another uh, robotic sledge turret. It's giving me two now. And let's try... I didn't bring my log picks. Let's just bash it open then. Hang on, I'm hungry. Why? Eat the dog food. At least I've given my picks some more upgrades so it'll be slightly more usable, but this is still pain. Let's check the munitions box. Ammo. Unsurprising. I don't need club parts, but I will sell them actually. But you know what I could put that one skill point into? Some fucking minor 69er. Ah, but it'll dilute the loot table before I can... Yeah, so I don't want to do that yet. Until I've got at least the level of vehicles that I need for a motorcycle. And probably not until I have workstations maxed either. Truly one of the systems of all time. Uh, Forge Ahead, Shotgun Weekly, Baseball Bat, maybe worth selling. Can I put that mod on anything? Maybe my helmet? There we go. A bit of speed boost back. Alright, let's go hunt down these last uh, survivors that I've missed. Oh, did I miss a room in there? Oh, of course. I forgot to check the shower. Oh, he's a feral. Is that a good shotgun for it? Let's go back to Jen and get a reward. Ooh, glue. Right, we need eight more vehicle magazines as well. Keep that in mind. If she offers me a book reward, I might just take it, just just to get a chance at reducing how many of those I have to deal with. There's another one. 
Hey, wow, Jan. I didn't think you had it in you. I'll take Good the crafting job. skill magazine bundle. Do you have another job? I don't have time to do it, but yeah. I'll take it. Oh, I would kiss you, but um, ah, there's another food mix. Apocalypse hygiene and all. So we need five more. In the morning, we will probably be able to get that if we just go out and find a few cars. That's nice. I'll finally be done with this. We can make chemistry stations now too, but I don't think I have the acid and stuff for it. I have a beaker at least. That's the hard part. But I don't really need a chemistry station at the moment anyway. Can't really make my own gas because where's the oil shield going to come from? And I can't really make my own ammo because, well, I could, but I just, there's no point yet. <laughs> I'm not that low on ammo yet. Ammo crafting might actually be a part of this series, though, but I won't be able to do as many infestations because, you know, they're a nightmare. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the morning. We'll do that one job and see if we can get a motorcycle. All right, here we are at Ranger Station something. I don't remember what one it was, but it was one of them. There's a bear over there. I have to be careful. Yeah, golf. Oh, hi, dog. Ooh. Of course, it lagged as I shot. Is there any vultures? No. Nope. Okay, right, well, we'll just do that. Start this. I've done this already. In this playthrough. Anyway. Hello? I expect the dogs this time. Is there three? Oh. Worse than a dog. Yeah, he survived that. That's messed up. Anyway, let's continue. Ah, cigar, nice. Right, that changes things. We can put a point in Pummel Pete. I wasn't expecting to actually find one. They're not the most common thing ever, but hey, I'll take it. Ah, some first aid. Oh, there's another zombie in here. Any of these containers? There we go. Ah, nothing. Anyone home? Don't grab this. Up we go. I'm expecting unspeakable hoarders in here. Hello. Hey, wake up. Is there any ferals in there? It doesn't seem like there is. Oh, one of them is. <laughs> he was pretending. Or did he just randomly start running for no reason? That's really weird. Oh well, no ferals works for me. Actually brought my lockpicks this time. Vehicle adventures, need four more of those. Come on, filing cabinet, give me one. Oh. Some ammo, weapons bag. Not too helpful there. Meds. Nice medical journal. Let's lockpick this. The game is feeling generous, that is. Forge ahead. Shotgun weekly. Some supplies. Let's open up these other containers. Forge ahead again. Another sledge turret. I've never had so many sledge turrets in one playthrough. <laughs> right, let's head back to Trader Gen. And see if we can get another tier 3 done today. And that should give us... Oh, that's unfortunate. It should give us a tier... Or complete, which might have something good for me. I'll keep an eye out for any cars, because those are probably my best bet for vehicle magazines right now. There's one. Eh, nothing. Okay, let's head over. Um, I will take those magazines. Oh, Right, Jen, come on, I have one tier 3 for me, a good one, a fetch maybe. Um, a clear, I could do that. That's the lumber mill again. Whoa. Um... I will take some more shotgun. Here's another vehicle adventures. We need three more. Oh, there's another one. Two more. Cars do seem to be my best bet in the wasteland because there's just so many of them. Another one. Okay, we need one more. I believe in you, game. You can give me one more car with a book in it. Oh, dog, fuck off. Here we are, though, at the lumber mill. Double loot this car. Nothing. Reset it. Try again. Nothing again. Well, it was worth a shot. Fuck that guy. Any boot containers in here? 
any desks or anything? No. In we go, I guess. Gotta be ready for, like, radiated lumberjacks, though. Uh, just a normal one, okay. Lucky headshot. Now, last time this had a radiated guy. And it does again. Wonder if it's somehow predisposed to have a radiated guy. Like, is it always a radiated guy? Like, even if you're in a normal biome? Because that's the radiated guy. Look out for him. Oh, hey. Ow. Let me eat a bandage. No one's hiding in here. Okay. Hey. Go away, please. Now there's a truck over here that is of interest to me. Nope. Let's try this building. Come on, give me a bookshelf, a filing cabinet, something like that. Oh, I'm hungry. That's annoying. Right, well, I've done all I can out here. Let's go inside. Oh, hi, Feral. Please go down. Let's try my luck with this one container. You might get a vehicle book in here. Eh, forge ahead. Can't complain, but it's not what I'm looking for. Oh, that's so many vultures. Did it spawn a vulture horde or something? Or is this just the wasteland being the wasteland? Ugh, you know what? They're not being much of a problem over there anyway. Let's just leave them alone for now. Right, let's do the same thing as before. Jump in here, open that, run away. Hope for the best. At least we actually got them all in one go this time. Nobody was sticking around waiting for me. Come on. Book container, you need to have this. Come on. Oh. Oh, a drum mech. Thank you, game. Let me put that on the AK. What do we have in here? Another forge ahead? Okay. Well, let's go back to Jen. Maybe I'll find a car on the way back or something. No luck there. Let's try this one. Nope, that was a big hitter. I did see another car over here, though. Nope, no luck there. Okay. There's plenty more, though. Ow. Stood in the landmine. That car's been searched already. All that for a car I've already searched. Well, shit. Maybe this house has a mailbox. That might also be a good chance. Ooh. Piss off, bird. There we go. Ugh. Still no book. It's like it knows I need one more and it goes, haha, no. Anybody home? Yes, a guy. Dealt with him, right? Come on. I believe. Oh, you're kidding. <laughs> That's like the first one of those in ages that hasn't given me a book. Or uh, a vehicle book. Very funny game. Very, very funny. Very funny game. Very funny. Let me in. I'm reloading. I need some food. A bookshelf. Ugh. Maybe I should hand this quest and I might get a, a crafting skill magazine bundle as a reward. It would be really dumb if I spent ages just hunting just to get that. Jen. If you were here, don't spend it all in one place. Oh, for fuck's sake. But if you do, make sure it's here. Okay, I'll take the uh, the club and I'll sell it to her. Oh, and it's not even tier four complete. I'm so sad. Hang on. Let's see. Uh, one, two, three. What is happening to my sound right now? Are you okay, game? Ugh. Anyway, as I was saying, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. What's nine times three? Ah, twenty-seven. We need to do a tier one. Uh, that'll do. Okay. Ah, and it's a mechanical place. Fantastic. And... Hey, there's some food in here. Let me just dump this temporarily because I got too much shit. Oh yeah, I should have bought food at the trader. Why am I like this? Right. Surely, I will get at least one in here. Also, I got a skill point there. I'm not sure what to put it into. Ah. Uh, I'll just hold on to it for now. Let's 
Oh, you're taking the piss. Tools Digest. Hey, biker. Hey, biker. Hey, biker. Steel. Okay. It's actually not going to give me it, is it? Well, at least I'll get tier 4 complete. What should we be selling one? And I just didn't notice. Oh, she has a car. Please no. Please no. Oh, thank God. I'm not a moron. Let me buy some food. Well, she might give me a food reward. Let me just check that first. Uh, let me take the magazine bundle. So, do I want food bundle, steel armor, or 4x4 parts? I don't want a 4x4 because it's just going to eat all of my shit. Steel armor is tempting, but I'd rather get a bonus bundle. So, I will actually take the food bundle. There, so tier 4 complete finally, and we get a bunch of spaghettis. Home cooking weeklies, come on. Give me the thing. Finally, there we go. Right, we can now officially make a thingy. Don't have an engine though, that is a minor problem. I have confirmed he was not selling any vehicle adventures books, so my sanity remains intact. Let's go collect everything we need for the motorcycle and see if I had maybe do have an engine. I don't know. I might have left one behind. But I don't think I have one. I've found one and I scrapped it early on, but let's see. Things I might need for this by the way. Like glue and uh duct tape or anything. No, okay. So I have the handlebars, so I don't have to worry about that at all. So it's just the chassis I need to worry about. I have that steel easily. My sound is completely stopped now. Thank you, seven days to die. Very cool. I just need two duct tape, which... There we go. There, we can craft the motorcycle chassis. Well, that does that. I need to go hunt down, first of all, a battery. Yeah, I got one. Cool. And then I need an engine. So let's take this thingy out, wrench, words, and see if I can hunt down a single engine. The game's going to be really funny, isn't it? And just not give me one. Okay, there was a bus next to my house. I swear, if this has a vehicle adventures in it, I'm going to cry. Oh, thank God. Right, let's see if I can get an engine from this. I could use beer right now. That would really help with the stamina issues. I'll check that at Trader Jen's in a second. Okay, no engine from that. Let's go check Jen for some beer. Maybe some hackers. It won't help me with the engine drop rate, but it'll help me get everything else a little bit easier. It would help if I brought money. Oh, she has no beer. Well, I'll take some coffee then. It's still a stamina boost. Another engine. Rude. There we go, an engine. Right, now we should be able to make a motorcycle. One motorcycle, please. There we go, finally. There we go. Oh, this is so much nicer than that fucking bicycle. I'm glad we finally got this. Before, like, day 14 or whatever. That's very helpful. I have to buy all my gas, but that's fine. This is going to save us a lot of time. You know, since I have the Crucible, it might be worth respecking now. Because I've got the Crucible, I've got one Crucible, and I've got uh, a chemistry stations available to me. If I was to spec out now, I could use those skill points a lot better. But we'll do that in the morning if we're going to do that. That can wait till the next episode. Remember, if you're looking for a 7 Days to Die server host, try level up hosting using the link in the comments or the description or using my code is prebuilt to get 10% off and I make a commission if you do that. Remember, my patrons and members do get early access to these videos, so if that interests you, be sure to click those links as well. Let me know if you're still enjoying the Wasteland series and in the meantime... Special thank you to my members and patrons. If you want to become one of those, there are links in the description to do so. If you enjoyed this video, why not check out another one? I would recommend the one on the top right. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.